What are seasons? Why do we have summer, winter, autumn, and spring? The earth is tilted. A season is a division of the year, based on changes in weather, ecology, and the number of daylight hours in a given region. In popular culture, seasons are often divided by calendar day irrespective of weather and other deciding factors. On Earth, seasons are the result of Earth's orbit around the Sun and Earth's axial tilt relative to the ecliptic plane. In temperate and polar regions, the seasons are marked by changes in the intensity of sunlight that reaches the Earth's surface, variations of which may cause animals to undergo hibernation or to migrate, and plants to be dormant. We divide up the year into four seasons. Spring, summer, autumn, and winter. Each season lasts three months with summer being the warmest season, winter being the coldest, and spring and autumn lining in between. The seasons have a lot of impact on what happens on the earth. In the spring, animals are born and plants come back to life. Summer is hot and is when kids are usually out of school and we take vacations to the beach. Often crops are harvested at the end of the summer. In autumn the leaves change colors and fall off the trees and school starts again. Winter is cold and it snows in many places. Some animals, like bears, hibernate in the winter while other animals, like birds, migrate to warmer climates. Why do seasons occur? Seasons are caused because of the Earth's changing relationship to the sun. The Earth travels around the sun, called an orbit, once a year or every 365 days. As the Earth orbits the sun, the amount of sunlight each location on the planet gets every day changes slightly. This change causes the seasons. The Earth is tilted. Not only does the Earth revolve around the sun every year, but the Earth rotates on its axis every 24 hours. This is what we call a day. However, the Earth doesn't rotate in a straight-up and down manner relative to the Sun. It is slightly tilted. In scientific terms, the Earth is tilted 23.5 degrees from its orbital plane with the Sun. Why does our tilt matter? The tilt has two major effects. The angle of the Sun to the Earth and length of the days. For half of the year the Earth is tilted such that the North Pole is more pointed towards the Sun. For the other half the South Pole is pointed at the Sun. When the North Pole is angled toward the Sun, the days on the northern part of the planet get more sunlight or longer days and shorter nights. With longer days, the northern hemisphere heats up and gets summer. As the year progresses, the Earth's tilt changes to where the North Pole is pointing away from the Sun producing winter. For this reason, seasons north of the equator are the opposite of seasons south of the equator. When it's winter in Europe and the United States, it will be summer in Brazil and Australia. Let's learn more. Spring flowers, summer heat, autumn leaves, and winter snow. These are familiar images of the four seasons. Seasons are not the same everywhere. But for people around the world, the changing seasons help mark the passing of the year. Why are there seasons? We have seasons because Earth is tilted. Earth is tilted on its axis as it orbits around the Sun. The axis is the imaginary line that runs between the North Pole and the South Pole. Earth rotates around this axis. Earth's tilt means that for half of the year, the North Pole is tilted toward the Sun. The South Pole is tilted away. The other half of the year, the South Pole is tilted toward the Sun and the North Pole is tilted away. The North Pole is in the Northern Hemisphere, the part of Earth where North America is found. The South Pole is in the Southern Hemisphere. When the Northern Hemisphere is tilted toward the Sun, it gets more direct sunlight for more time each day than does the Southern Hemisphere. This makes the days longer in the North. The air and the oceans warm in the sunlight, and the temperature goes up. These are the months of spring and summer. When it's summer in one hemisphere, it's winter in the other. When it's spring in one hemisphere, it's autumn in the other. If Earth wasn't tilted, the sunlight would be the same all year round. The sun would rise and set at the same time each day. There would be no seasons. This is what it's like near the equator, 
the imaginary line that circles the planet around its middle. Earth still has only a small effect there, so the seasons change very little. Solstices Have you ever heard of a solstice? There are two solstices every year, one in June and one in December. On about June 21st, the North Pole is tilted farther toward the Sun than it is at any other time of the year, and the South Pole is tilted farther away from the Sun. The June solstice is the beginning of summer in the Northern Hemisphere. The Northern Hemisphere gets more sunlight on the June solstice than on any other day of the year. On the same day, it's the beginning of winter and the shortest day of the year in the Southern Hemisphere. On about December 21st, the positions of the North and South Poles are reversed. The December solstice marks the beginning of summer in the Southern Hemisphere. That's why Australians can celebrate Christmas sunbathing on the beach. The same day marks the start of winter in the north. Equinoxes Two times each year, day and night, are the same length all over the world. These days are called the equinoxes. The equinoxes mark the beginnings of spring and fall. They occur on or about March 21st and September 23rd. Seasons Celebrated Since ancient times, Societies have celebrated the solstices and equinoxes to mark the change of the seasons. Traditionally, crops are planted with the arrival of spring. Many crops are harvested with the onset of fall. Both seasons are greeted around the world with festivals and celebration. Longest and Shortest Days In the Northern Hemisphere, the longest day is on June 21st, while the longest night is on December 21st. It's just the opposite in the Southern Hemisphere, where the longest day is December 21st and the longest night is June 21st. There are two days a year where the day and night is exactly the same. These are September 22nd and March 21st. To take quiz on this video please visit kimavi.com and search by seasons. Watch similar videos at kimavi via hashtags. Hashtag science, earth science seasons. Please write to us at admin at kimavi.com and help us improve our educational videos. What are seasons? Why do we have summer, winter, autumn, and spring? The earth is tilted 